Let's get it in! Let's get it in! Mm, 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 mm. You don't want this work! You don't want it, boy! Get body! What's up, YouTube? What's going on, Corey Kitchen? And welcome back to this horror game, Subnautica. Okay, back to uh, back to this game. Uh, <laughs> every time, I'm telling you, every time I load up this game, it's just like, what's gonna happen to me this time? You guys told me that I need a workbench, and I was like, wait, how the freak do I get that? It turns out I need to find. Oh, and my battery just died. Guess before we freaking go start the episode, I gotta build some batteries because I can't do nothing without my Anchor Breaker 2.0. That's one copper. Very good, very good. You guys remember when I used to be scared of these things though? Man, your boy is coming a long way, but oh my gosh. There's still so many terrifyingly horrible things underneath this horrible place. Power cell. So we can get our ankle breaker 2.0 some juice because he like oh, I'm so thirsty. There you go, buddy. There you go. Alright, so now we can officially start the episode. Um, we need workbench fragments, and I went ahead and looked up where those are, and they're in two different biomes. The freaking, I don't know what it's called. It's called like blood. No, it's not called blood grass, but that's what I'm calling it. It's it's like the red grass area. I know it's like super close to where I built my base. In this area, we do have, uh, what's it called? These things, which I'm kind of afraid of. But you guys know what I'm really afraid of. You guys know what I'm really afraid of. <sighs> Get your breath, Corey. I just don't like how eerie they make it. Like, they know they make this game scarier than they should. Hold up, what's... What's that? What's this? Oh! Woo! We just... Hey! Maybe it's gonna be a good episode, fam! We just got a work fragment. Oh, that's, that's what I'm talking... A work bench fragment, not work fragment. That's what I'm talking about. We didn't have to be down there long at all. Ah, like that. But I do... I do want to just get out of the mode of being afraid to explore because... That's the only way I'm gonna be able to find stuff. I'm just gonna put this on in here. Woo! Oh yeah! So that's probably gonna take a while to do. All right, well let's go ahead and uh, make a fish tank. Um, I guess we can make it in here, in this like little room. Ooh! Hey! Dang, this mug tall as me! So I heard you can catch fish and keep them in here. Um, so hold up, Let, let's try and find a peeper, because I mean like if I'm running low on hunger, I could be like, yo Tom, um, uh, it's about that time, you know, you know the reason why I brought you here. New technology created. Workbench fragment, okay, hold up, hold up, before we do anything else, workbench, two titanium wiring kit and computer chip. Okay, titanium is easy. What do we need for a wiring kit? Uh, silver ore. Six and a half hours later. Oh, silver ore! Yes! Uh, eh, eh. All right, computer chip got. Now I think with that I can make a workbench up in this second. Oh, it's gotta be in an observatory. It's gotta be here. This is where all the mastermind stuff goes down. So. Diamond blade you can get diamonds in this game. Oh You you gotta be able to take down a reaper with this and then you could get a heat blade knife and battery That's so easy to get tank plus steel tank extra light tank. What is that? What does that mean? high capacity tank? <gasps> we could just we can make this right now. Hold up. Let me go get two titanium real quick. All right high capacity tank What's good? Dang! Dang! Wait, hold up. Did that that added like 30 seconds, I think. I might be able to free up some inventory space actually instead of just having extra amount of oxygen. I mean, if I could just upgrade one and then just have one, that would save me some inventory space while you plan. Hey, you look cool. You could go in my fish tank and so can you. All right. Now I got the fish tank. I can go ahead and put this in there. And a couple of these right here. Oh, look at this. Put a peeper. No, I actually want to eat that peeper. Look at all my fish, though. As soon as I'm about to die, all of you are going to die. All right, let me put that tank in there. 
oxygen still at the same yes dude i just freed up so much space so what else fins ultra glide fins swim charge fins it charges your handheld tool while you swim what that's clean but i want those freaking uh ultra glide fins all right uh ultra glide fins hey all right so you know we gotta test this junk ultra glide fins Ooh, increases swim speed okay let's see what this plasteel tank is i think it's let me see what it does uh it still takes up the same amount of spaces i thought it was gonna maybe like take up one square or something but it still takes up four spaces the picture is just smaller like i wasn't gonna notice that last but not least we gotta freaking make this heat blade which is pretty easy just gotta go make a battery real quick y'all gotta name my fish okay if we name them i'm not allowed to eat them so y'all better hurry up and name them fish i don't know how many were in there but shoot i i can't eat stuff that have names Woo! look how fast i'm swimming though i am swimming faster i am swimming way faster all right heat blade Let's go! Woohoo! Eh! Yo! Yo! Oh my gosh, bro. This is epic. I'm like, ah! Ah! Bruh. Oh my! Are you serious? All integrity restored. Dang! Alright, something that I really wanted to do in this episode was build a uh, moon pool. And I saw that the moon pool fragments are in the Grand Reef area, which I never heard of. So first of all, I need a compass to know that I'm going south because that's where I saw that it was. This game never ends. Okay. <laughs> all right. So uh, think Siri, can I talk please? Things are about to get really lit. Okay. So what happened is I just looked up how to get a compass. I need something called magnetite for this junk to even show up in the fabricator. And so I'm looking up where this at. This junk is in some jelly caves or something. So I got to go to the jelly caves to get the magnetite to get the compass to go south to go to the Grand Reef to get the stuff that I need for the moon pool. You see how this stuff works by now? The cool thing though is I can use my signal to get to the freaking caves. However, I read that it's super dark there. So... <sighs> What the freak? Get it off! You scum! Oh, that's what that thing is? That sucker grabbed onto me! I see how it is. So you just gonna grab onto me like that. Get your freaking face slit in! Get your freaking face slit! Scum! Ever talk to me again! I've been drinking. I've been drinking. Flashlight. Uh-huh, we're gonna need one of those. Gotta borrow two more fish. Sorry, guys. <laughs> so we're out on an adventure. 1,100 meters this way? Seriously? Terraformer fragment? Woo! What is that? Oh my gosh, guys. These sharks are all over the freaking place. This is insane. Look how deep we are. We're in 100 meters. We're 100 meters deep, guys. Hold up, what's this? What's this? Propulsion cannon? Woo! Hold up, what the freak? Let me get up in here. Get up in here. Dude, I'm finding so much crap right now. Matter of fact, I want to go back to my base. Because if I die, I ain't losing this stuff. Ooh, propulsion cannon fragment. Terraformer fragment. Cave opening, yes, 1070. Going in the right direction. Guys, this is my worst fear, okay? I know some people would be like, man up, Corey. But th this is it for me, alright? I am I, I can do animatronics. I can do horror games of all kinds. Jump scares here and there. But do you talk about the freaking deep ocean? Oh my goodness. That's where I have to draw the line. I'm sorry. I am sorry. Alright. Uh, is this a cave? Well, that's not really a cave. Uh, let me see. Am I going the right way? 1070. Why am I still 1070? Is it this way? Oh, it's a reef back up there. That's cool. Look at all these reef backs out here. What the freak is going on? What is this? Why is all that stuff falling like that? 
Is it? Is this a cave? Is this a cave right now? Caution. Passing safe depth. I think this is a cave right now. Um. Oh. Why the frick does my vision keep doing that? I don't need you to uh, orientate me for me, okay? I can do that. Dude. Dude. Oh my. Woo! Caution. Mild dehydration detected. Fluid intake recommended. Guys, look at this. Oh my gosh. Woo! Oh. <laughs> Hold up, we're 200 meters. We're 200 meters, bro. Can this hurt me? Can I knife it? Can I eat this? Yes, yes. Give me that. Ooh. So clean with it. I could just freaking... Ooh, look at his gold, bro. I could just freaking smack those things in the face and eat them. And I got cooked. It's cooked for me. Getting a lot of gold, but uh, I'm pretty sure this is the jelly caves that I read about. And it said it's supposed to drop some magnite or something. Unless I could go in here. What is this? Magnetite! Ayy! So you can go inside of those things. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, guys. This is very good. Very good right now. Your boy is going hard. Do we go inside of these? Yes. Give me more. Give me more. Give me more. Guys, this episode, your boy is balling out. Give me more. You got another one? I don't want lithium. Dude, this game is so awesome. Like, I've never played a game that I've been more terrified of. But at the same time, giving me, like, such amazing gameplay. Like, like this game, I think I got, like, 12 hours in so far. And it's just, like, oh my gosh. Yes. Give me... For real? Oh, shoot. Oh, no! Get to the boat! Oh, no! Get to the boat! Get to the boat! Oh! Oh, wait till I get some freaking guns that can actually hurt them. You know what? I got my freeze. I got my freeze ray. Come out then. Catch work! Scum? Yeah, get frozen. I'm trying to get my stuff. Where they at though? Where they at though? Freeze! Freeze! Uh huh. Wait, where's my boat? Where's Where's my boat? There it is. There it is. See, Ma's ankle breaker. You ready to get out of here? I don't like this place. I'm sure you don't either. All right. How do we get in here? I don't know if I'm getting deeper in the cave or closer to the exit. I don't know. Everything looks the same. Yes, guys. I found a hole. Found the way out. All right. Now I'm, I'm back deep again. I want to just go straight towards my base. Guys, we just conquered our first underwater cave. Clap that up. Woo! All right. All right. Look at your boy making strides, though. Can I just say a couple a couple episodes ago, I was afraid of those stalkers, man. The freaking, uh, those guys. I mean, those guys are still pretty scary, but. All right, so we made it back. We got the magnetite thing. So it, the compass, yep, the compass pops up now. I hate that. I wish that everything just popped up as it was. Oh, and I wanted to uh, put our Oculus in the uh, fish tank because I never came across that creature before. So that'd be a really cool creature to uh, have in here. It looks like uh, a peeper but like weird version. All right, you guys gotta name the Oculus, all right? Name the Oculus. I can build a, oh, not advanced wiring kit. Don't build anything on accident. Compass, yes. Finally, I have a compass. Dude, that's awesome. All right, now that I got the compass, I could go south to try and find the Grand Reef. But I mean, like, I I don't think that this thing could go below 225 meters, which is stupid because I could have swore I saw some gameplay of people just going deep as crap, like it's 800 meters. But now I can't go 225, and I'm pretty sure those freaking reefs are like super deep too. So I don't know. <gasps> A 
found it. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Dude. Dude. What is this? Oh my gosh, bro. Membrane tree. Aluminum oxide crystal? What the freak? Uh, the salt chunk? Uranium? Yo! We going beast right now. Hey, hold up, what's that? What's that? What's that? Moon pool fragment? Let's go! Woo! I can build moon pools! Oh my gosh. Next episode, you already know. Warning, 30 seconds of oxygen All right, Siri. Dang, I'm excited. Next episode, because the base that we have now, I'm, I'm not really happy Warning. with. They can't play no music for me. Diamond! Oh my gosh! Bro. 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 This is the best episode of Subnautica ever. We are deep as free. Bone sharks. They're always hating on my swag. Always hating on my swag. Always hating on my swag. Oh, he tried to he tried to hurt my ship. Oh, I'm stuck. I froze my ship, you brainiac. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. Uh, there you go. There you go, bro. You know what? You know what? Where you at? I'll show y'all how much Corey has evolved. Let's get it in! Let's get it in! Mm, 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 mm. You don't want this work! You don't want it, boy! Get bodied! <sighs> Thermal plant? Thank you. We're just balling out. We handle bone sharks. Bone sharks aren't a problem for the freaking heat blade katana. All I needed was that compass the entire time, and I could have been found this place. How much stuff? Oh, dude, I'm I'm so full right now. Let's go back. And I learned a note. Oh wait, my health was going down on my sea moth, unless I just crashed into something. Yep, probably just crashed into something. Dude, we're definitely coming back because we didn't even really get into the reef portion. All right, made it back like a freaking boss. Okay, so I mean. I got a whole bunch of stuff now. Terraformer, blueprint, build and destroy terrain? What? So aluminum oxide crystals for heat, for fire and heat protection. Yo, are y'all proud of me right now? Like, like, for real though? Like, please tell me y'all proud of me. Really quick, let's build this diamond blade. Are you serious? Hold up, hold up. So the description is ultra sharp blade. Man, it looked like a normal blade. They couldn't have freaking made it like shiny or something. We got a diamond blade anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and keep my freaking heat, heat katana out. Cause we got a buttload of stuff for this thing now. Uh, like a moon pool fragment. Thank you. And that's where we're gonna end it. So man, we made so much progress in this episode. So next time I'm gonna try and build a little like the beginning of my new base off screen so i could just go ahead and install that moon pool at the beginning of the next episode we still got to figure out what the thermal plan is i also want to see if we could go back to the aurora and freaking try and get another power upgrade because then if i could get this thing this freaking cyclops to be awesome on power i would navigate in it also the terraformer and the freaking propulsion cannon like we got so much stuff i believe i'm actually gonna go mlg in the next episode hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to assist us in samurai slice that like button subscribe today to join the samurai and until next time my brothers and sisters because my name is gary kenton you know what i'm saying <laughs>